Hi all, welcome to my channel. I'm Mark. This is Mark's Mods, guys, and please do not adjust your sets. I have had my latest delivery of Rossi bike, and in that was the free gift of the T-shirt. Yes, it is this colour. Um, you should actually see it in real life. It, the camera doesn't pick it up. It's literally nearly a luminous. It's the kind of um, thing I would have put on my children when they were young, so we could notice them in a crowd. So you kind of put something high vis on, and then you know where they are. But uh, yeah, okay, it's a build T-shirt, and I wear it for the build. But we are going to be doing our Valentino Rossi build today. Mine's a T-shirt, and minus because I can't find my sunglasses anywhere. Uh, to try and turn this down and try and focus on it. So at least I'm going to be a beacon somewhere along the line. Anyway, we're definitely going to be doing our Valentino Rossi today. We're going to be doing issue 48. Now, I have not got a bit of a backlog on this one anymore. We're more or less caught, caught up. Um, issue 48 is what I got in my last pack. And then what came yesterday, um, I've got my rest of my next lot of issues. So they'll be coming out the weekly now. So it's only one issue to do. But guess what, guys? It's more pipes. More pipes and more working on the engine. Hopefully this week we'll have a lot better look than we did last week of everything breaking on us Which it tends to be doing on this model a lot at the moment and I did have a bit of a rant about that one I do apologize, but I was just getting so frustrated with the build that every time I touched it something needed Fixing on it. It was just not the great quality, but we're gonna start the week nice and optimistic that everything's gonna go right today So let's get started on this one with fingers crossed. So with all that said Let's get modelling. Okay guys, stage 48. So we're going to be working on the hydraulic pipe work today. So very interesting. Uh, so what we need is we need this piece of piping. And we need this piece here. Now this piping is the 50mm long piping. And what we're going to do is we're just going to slot the pipe onto the just like so just move that to one side because we've got another two pieces of piping so this is the longest piece this is 95 millimeters long and then we have this piece here this is 45 millimeters long now we've got this part here now what we want us to do is the shorter piping is going to go onto the top here if i can get it in okay now we've got a bit of pipe in here that's going off to an angle okay and we're going to put the longer piece in to that okay just like so right so we need to bring our bike over now looking at it from this way this is it this is what they've got in the magazine we are going to put the first pipe we worked on uh right okay so we're going to put one part into there so it's going to go that bit into there if i can line it up and then the top part into there but the problem is that's in the way ah right it's this they keep doing it upside down they show you what it's going to where it's going to go and then you have to flip it i'm gonna say it's sometimes quite funny how the instructions have you do this and that is a tight fit it's something to sort of push down on that one Let's see if a screwdriver is going to get it in for my, which it has done that side. And it has done that side, so just using the back of a screwdriver. I think that one came for the DeLorean build. Okay, so we've done that, that's in place. Okay, so what we need to grab next is, oh goodness me. Right, so I missed a bit of a stage out here. Sorry about that. I missed stage three out. We need this piece from here. And this is going to slot in 
just onto there. This is me rushing. Okay, and then this pipe's going to come down and then go in just into just into there like so okay right so we need to get this piece now i'm just seeing which side we're working on again it's a case of so we're working on this side here now oh it's got it we're going to make sure i put it in the correct way <laughs> because like i said it flips it so it can be a little bit confusing but i'm sure it goes in just like that i'm just gonna double check i think that might need some glue on it oh, maybe not you know what, I am going to put some glue in it anyway, just to, you know what things are like on this build. It can be a little bit of a nightmare. I'm not putting a lot. I just want enough to keep it in place. Okay, so we will now apply that place. It's quite an easy fit, that's why. I'm thinking about it. Okay, so that's now in place. Just double checking. <sighs> Making sure, yes, that's all, that is all correct. Okay, it just says step seven is check that support bracket is fitted flush. I should in a photo, if necessary, use a little glue to ensure that the assembly is secure, which we've done. Okay. Last thing we need to do is this piece here. This is a dummy nut, and that's just going to go onto here. There. So actually, nothing to uh, to screw in today. And they're just going to push that down with a screwdriver. Again, that's very loose. Hmm. Not too keen on how loose that is. Let's just see if it'll go down any further. No, that is very, very loose. So what we'll do just uh, try and get it out. Yeah, you see if it's gonna come out by hand, it's gonna to need to be glued in. Okay, that's not a problem. <sighs> Let's get our little glue tray. I'm going to change this at some point for a new one. Oh, I'm a stickler for using things until the very last. Until there's just no use out of it whatsoever. But I'm just going to put a little glue just on the inside. Just give it something to grab onto. I think we've got quite so much to do with it being only one issue and it's not a very quick one. Right, hoping some that glue grabs that and that's it. So that is the result of that. So not a bad issue this one, nothing broke. Uh, we did have to secure a couple of things down, but that's fine. That's stopped moving now, so that's nice and secure. So that is stage 48 complete. Well, guys, that's it for the Rossi. And touch wood, everything went smooth on that one. Um, not a bad issue at all. Everything seemed to go where it should do. Nothing broke, which is great. Um, so, yeah, um, it is going to be coming out just one issue per week now. Unless we get another bit of um, a bit of a stock in where I can do two a week but uh, I'm quite happy doing that one a week because that model can be a complete nightmare to work out sometimes so keeping to one a week will be nice and simple for me and hopefully fingers crossed and touch wood we don't get any more problems so yeah so I'm going to go take this t-shirt off so I don't look like a light bulb anymore and 
No, I'll tell you the truth, I could use this and I could illuminate the house and it wouldn't cost as much. No, don't go there, Mac. Anyway, if you like this video, please give this a massive thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell and be notified of any future videos. But as for always, guys, stay safe and bye for now.